He's not in the starting lineup today. Uh, he's been in the headlines, though, of course. Um, his agent um, said his time at United is done. He said it before, their biggest game of the season, the day before. Uh, your views on that? I think the timing is, is disgusting mm. uh, from, from a player's agent, an important player at the club's agent. But I, I'm going to shift the focus more to Manchester United and Ole Gunnar Solskjaer, Ed Woodward probably as well is how are you allowing an agent to come in and talk like this? This isn't the first but time. But how do you stop an agent doing an interview? You nip it in the bud the first time he does it. Now, this isn't the first time Mino you know, Raiola has yeah. spoken like this about a player and, and pushed the, the focus on Manchester United. Nip that in the bud from the first time. Sh shouldn't, at, shouldn't Paul Pogba be the one nipping wait, this? Wait, I, I, was at, I was at United when Wayne Rooney was talking about a, a contract. Yeah. We were all there. He was talking about leaving yeah. Manchester United. So Alex Ferguson went in the media... Mm. straight away and said, listen, he's been advised badly by his agents and this will not happen again, I'm going to nip it in the bud. A couple of days later, Wayne Rooney signs a new contract. If you don't nip these things in the bud, mm. Van der Beek comes in, doesn't play. His agent, after the, in the first month, speaking in the media. How is that happening? Mm. You've uh, got to control yeah, well, it. I don't think the club have to respond to that. Why not? Because... So every, age, every player that comes into the club, their agent's well, going to be sitting well, there. It's quite why, rare why for agents to speak out like why that. Why give the it? agents a time of day? Paul yeah. Pogba is the problem. This man, rep Paul pays this yeah. man to represent him. I agree with you. A lot. Now, Paul, is, <laughs> and he represents us a lot, and he rep represents him badly, because yeah. Paul is a good lad. Now, everybody looking on the outside, because of his agent, they'll think he's a bad lad, he's trouble in the dressing room. Yeah. He isn't. Now, there's two options I think Paul has. He either tells him to shut up or he sacks him. Mm. I, I agree with that, but what I'm saying to you, Man United should be taking it out of that. They shouldn't be waiting for a player to talk. Man United but, is a but, big, massive institution. Real, Man United have got enough on the plate trying uh, to get the team yeah. to where they should be. It, it, and they're being destabilised by an agent and they're allowing it. Well, they shouldn't be destabilised. What destabilised? Well, why are we talking about it now? We're talking about yeah, a game, the most important yeah, game of the season. Destabilising us and fans, I don't think the team's destabilised. So Do you have think an if you was in the team today, you'd be bothered about it? So when we was in the team and Wayne Rooney's talking about, uh, oh, they're talking about going to, to Chelsea or going to Man City... But they that, they, they weren't doing that publicly, we, we though, were they? We don't, I don't want that. I don't need that. We don't want that yeah. to be out in the, in the public no, domain. You don't need it, but I don't think it affects you, does it? No, but it's, 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 real. it's, well, you know it's the biggest pressure that you don't need. You know what the biggest problem with this is? The only person that's gained out of this whole transaction is the agent. Mm. Manchester United haven't got the Paul Pogba they anticipated. Paul Pogba's stock isn't at the level that it was that they paid £90 million for. So both of them are in a worse off position, but Raiola, what, I mean, he's supposed to quoted that he got 20 or 30 million pounds for, for this transaction. Mm. And then on the top of that, he's going to be critical of, of the fact that his player needs to get out of there. That's impossible. You know, Scholes is right. Scott, Paul is a good, a player, Paul's a good I, I kid. I agree, yeah. But if Paul shouldn't player, let him talk, if, if put player, his name in his if mouth. If I'm the player, you, you're the player, you control the agent. You control, he's not meant I think to be he should, for you. Yeah. Exactly, I agree 100% with you, yeah? yeah? I would say, shut up, what are you talking about? Yeah. Don't speak on my behalf and make me look bad. But what I'm saying, take that out of it. If you're, if you're at Manchester United, own that situation. Don't let be dictated to and be controlled in yeah, that Sir situation. Sir would have grabbed hold of that. You, you can't allow this to happen because every other player that comes in, the player's not playing or he's disgruntled. The agent's going to be in the paper talking. That's disrespectful. Don't have it. Yeah. I, I, look, I, I don't disagree. But I, we're, yeah, we're here talking about the, one of the biggest games in Manchester United in a long time. Yeah. And we're talking about agents. Awful, Awful time. But, yeah, but yeah. we're not talking yeah, about the football, I, which I, I think is, that, is crazy. It affects media and journalism and fans to some, mm. to some capacity, but... It I don't, the I don't think the it affect. I don't it think it affect the game tonight. No, no, you don't. I don't I, no, you don't I, think I, that. No, no, I agree, but it affects the mood at the club. You mm. want the club, the club to have a, a good outlook. You want the club to be seen in, in, in a good light. The more Man United allow this stuff to happen, the more Man United is under a certain amount of, of a cloud. Mm. Would you think this probably, happened at Liverpool? I, I think probably the only way to start this is to get rid of both of them. I, 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 so, I, I, what, would you, what would you think if you looked across the dressing room and that agent player was sitting next to you before a game of this magnitude? You'd be looking at him a bit Absolutely. funny. Tell your manager yeah. to shut your agent to shut up. Yeah, you, yeah, yeah. It, it probably takes a lead in the dressing room. Probably Harry Maguire should be pull him to one side say, look, ring your agent on the way home, <laughs> tell him to shut up or <laughs> sack him. Oh, we just say, hold on, we're, we're now done, yeah? <laughs> Important player at Liverpool. Wasn't playing earlier in the season. He's, he's got a new contract, maybe being negotiated or not. You don't see his agent coming out and speaking because he knows his agent will get slapped down by a club. You don't Shut see up. anybody's agent coming out. It's only this. No. Does it's anybody it's know Messi's yeah. agent, by the way? It's trouble. He's allowed. He's allowed to. He's dad. <laughs>